this is a video for absolute or incremental setting first in other parameter 300 absolute encoder setting this is a bit parameter the method for setting is uh, for example x is d2 so from right to left the first bit is d0 so x d2 is a d0 d1 d2 if your x is absolute here is 1 if your y is uh, absolute here is 1 if your z is absolute here is 1 if your y is incremental then here is one this is a method for bit parameter setting okay and uh, access parameter here you can set the floating zero or mechanical zero if you are using absolute in encoder motor then you can set the home to be floating home for example x y z so d3 0 d, d0 d1 d2 d3 if you are using incremental then zero if you, you are using absolute for x here is one this is a method for bit parameter setting. Th this sample is using meaning controller. If you use lace controller, then maybe the parameter number is not the same, but the method and the parameter name is the same. Just the number is not the same. Okay, so other pa other parameter is uh, about home here if you are using mechanical home so here is for setting the direction when home you want a positive direction or negative you can set here also the bit parameter and uh, the switch you are using is normally open or normally closed. You also can set here. The same method. D0 means X and the 1 means normally closed. So if your switch for X home is normally closed, you can set D1, D0, sorry, D, D0, X is 1. Okay. And here is for setting the home mode. Zero means uh, uh, after it back home and uh, reverse to check the moto encoder. If you set one, then it will reverse and no need to check the moto encoder. And here, if you are uh, power on the controller, here if you set one, then no need to check home. If you set nine, it means when you power on the uh, controller, if you using absolute motor, it knows the motor position, then you can run the controller. If you are using incremental, here need to set one.